All right, guys, welcome back to the podcast. My name is Kenny and Ziska. Appreciate you tuning in. I've got a great episode lined up for you guys today. If you haven't been following me on social media, Facebook, Instagram, etc., I often do live videos. And what I wanted to do today is share the audio from one of those live videos with you today. I try to take the most popular videos that I've done, extract the audio, and and share it with you here on on the podcast so that you don't have to go around hunting uh, on, on Facebook to find these very raw and kind of off-the-cuff, uh, non-rehearsed, non-scripted episodes that I do. So I hope you guys enjoy these these episodes that I share with you guys. But before we get into today's episode, just have a very uh, quick reminder, actually a couple of reminders for you guys. Number one, if you haven't already done so, would appreciate it if you take the time to go over to iTunes, made it easy for you guys. Just go to kenyanzitska.com slash iTunes, take you right to the page where you can leave a review, leave a rating, uh, subscribe to the show. And also if you know of someone who would benefit from hearing the various uh, strategies, uh, mindset, the tools, whatever it may be, whatever we talk about here on the podcast, if you know someone who would benefit from, from listening to it, would appreciate it if you share it with them, would appreciate it if you got the word out about what we're talking about here. Uh, so secondly, uh, if you want to take these strategies and, and tools and really implement them and need the guidance and the accountability to do so, uh, we have a couple opportunities for you guys to do that. First is our mastermind. This is a tight-knit group of guys who are doing the work necessary to implement these various strategies that we talk about here on the podcast into their lives so that they can get the results, build the discipline, regain control over their time, and 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 live life on their terms. You can apply to be a part of our mastermind program, the Infinite Results Mastermind Program at kenyanzitska.com slash results. But if you want that one-on-one accountability, want to work with me on a very deep level and want customized solutions, don't want that cookie cutter uh, BS that that a lot of people are pushing these days, I encourage you to apply to be a part of, of my discipline coaching program. This is an elite program, exclusive program, very limited uh, with the number of clients that I take on with this program. So you can apply at kenyanziska.com slash discipline. So without any further ado, let's jump into today's episode. All right, I'm back and don't know what happened there. Must have hit a uh, dead spot, but uh, looks like we're full back up and running. So not sure where where the video cut off here, but uh, if you didn't catch some, some of my posts from earlier today, uh, today's my daughter's birthday. She turned uh, turned four. Time's flying by. I know that's cliche to say, but um, I'm, I'm titling this video "Do Something Unexpected" uh, because I did something unexpected, uh, so something that I uh, personally don't expect of myself, and that's to. Uh, um, cut out of work unexpectedly and um i actually had i made arrangements to uh to uh meet someone for lunch and and also got the idea to uh hey you know what maybe give my daughter a little little quick surprise uh and and uh, stop by the aquarium which was not too far from where i was meeting my uh meeting my uh my buddy justin myers uh, for a quick uh, quick little lunch meetup and uh, you know, it it was a hectic lunch hour, but you know, it turned out great. I got got to catch up with uh, you know s- someone uh, you know who I hold in high regard in the uh, local business community here. He's also a veteran. Um, you know, it just was great to quickly catch up with him, and then then I scooted down to the uh, aquarium, and then uh, and then up here, as you can see, I'm wearing my uniform, uh, making up some drills. So it. Uh, you know, my mindset would be like, no, don't, uh, don't, don't try and, uh, try and do all that on your lunch hour. Don't try and cram all that stuff in during the day. But I was like, you know what, let me see what happens here. Let me see, um, how hard I can push myself a little bit. I know it doesn't sound like I was pushing myself, uh, that, that hard, uh, today, but you know what, 
I crammed a lot of stuff into my into my uh, my lunch hour here. Not saying not to sell any of that one in any one of those things short, but you know what? Um, you know, I got a lot accomplished in a short amount of time by doing something unexpected, something that I normally wouldn't allow myself to do. And you can extend that to many, many other areas um, of your life. Do something unexpected for your wife. Do something unexpected at work. You know, hold hold the door for a stranger. You can you can uh, you can name a whole array of things that you can do unexpectedly, and not uh, and I don't mean from a negative viewpoint either. Do something that uh, do something that uh, you know gets you out of your comfort zone too. Maybe it's it's uh, standing up for someone who's uh, being harassed. Maybe it's maybe it's uh, raising your hand when no one else is uh, you know speaking up on an issue or topic or isn't voicing their opinion. Hey Dave, what's up? Appreciate you uh, appreciate you tuning in. Sorry, I can't. I see some other comments there. I'm driving right now, so I can't pay attention to every single one here. So appreciate everyone who's uh, dropping comments too. But. Uh, yeah, it's you know it, it's it's only hard if you allow yourself to make it out to be hard in your mind. And I think I've really uh, I've uh, not really turned over a new leaf isn't the right uh, term I want to use here, but you can really you can really start pushing your your bubble that you're you're finding yourself in if you do something unexpected. Hell, you know, start off with something simple. Take a new way to work. Um, you know, learn. Pick up a pick up a uh, if you, if you're a nonfiction book uh, reader, pick up a fiction novel and start reading it. Do something that's gonna that's gonna push your uh, comfort zone. I know I've been reading these uh, these uh, crazy uh, woo woo uh, self help books a lot. Maybe I need to uh, pick up a novel and read that and uh, see. Uh, See what that does for me. Change up the uh, change up your routines, and that's another that's another uh, point. You can get really really caught up into your day to day routine, so that's another reason it's important to do something unexpected because you you might be you, you'll never know when you're going to surprise yourself. So that's uh, that's all I got for you guys today. Short, sweet, to the point. Um, you know, if you're watching the replay. Uh, let me know that you watch the replay, hashtag replay, or uh, hashtag uh, the, what's that funny green uh, thing you're wearing, something to that effect. Or if you're here uh, watching live, let me know, just like Dave and, uh, and uh, everyone else has. And, and also, if you haven't uh, joined my, my uh, Zero Excuses Facebook group, head on over there, kenyanziska.com slash group. Take you right to where you need to, need to go for that. And uh, if you like this message, also uh, you know, pump the heart a couple times, or or if this pisses you off too, I can I can handle it. Give me an angry face too. Um, that's all I got, guys. Have an awesome day. Chat with you later.